Hey guys, what's up? It's Sunny and welcome to a brand new video. So this video is really freaking exciting because I got a big box of German candy from Quentin. And I'm so thankful and so excited and oh my god, I got so much candy I can't even. Anyway, so today I'm gonna try all the German candy and rate it from 1 to 10. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing I found in this box was this, uh, which is uh, I love Twitch wristband. And also this thing right here, I have no idea what it is. But I think it is like clapsticks, as I like to call them. Yeah. Oh shit, yeah, it is clapsticks. Clapsticks hype! I love clapsticks. I'll save them for later. Anyway, so I posted that photo of this box on Facebook yesterday and all of you guys were like, Oh my god, you have to try the knoppers! So the knoppers looks like this. Um, yeah. Open it. Looks like a cracker. Oh jeez, it looks good. Uh, Mm, yeah, that is good. I like that. The German candy is off to a great start. Um, that is actually one of the best things I've had in a while because I'm so sick of all the Norwegian candy because I eat it all the time and it's so exciting actually trying something new and this Knoppers thing was great. So I think I actually give it a 9 out of 10. Over to the next product, which is... Oh shit. Uh, which is like Brausebrocken. Ahoy Brause. Oh. Okay, I thought it would I thought it would be like a caramel, but it's just a cube. I'm not sure if you're supposed to eat it like this. Ow! I'm done with the brows uh, broken. I'll give it a 7 out of 10. It was a little bit too hard. What what else can I find in here? I got a lot of the knoppers. That is a good thing. Now I can try the Hanuta. Hanuta Hasselnuss sh Schnitte. Oh Jesus, it's broken. Um, yeah, now my table is messy, whatever, doesn't matter. Okay, looks a little bit like the knoppers. The knoppers look a little bit better, honestly, <laughs> not gonna lie. Okay, let's try. It tastes like a slice of bread with Nutella, so it's like literally just what I eat for school. And I will give it a 7 out of 10, um, because I like the knoppers more. Now over to the next thing, which is called Pickup. Um, it is wild berry and it seems like it's white chocolate and a biscuit uh. All right, so uh, the pickup looks like this Okay, that is honestly the weirdest thing I've had like ever. It's not bad though, but it's weird It has wild berries in the middle Like in the middle of the chocolate or the white thing that I don't know what it is I'll give it a 6 out of 10 because it was weird uh. By the way, I just have to say that uh, I don't mean to offend anyone by giving these ratings. It's just so that you know what I think about the products. Anyway, so now I want to try all the different Milkas because I got like, okay, let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, boom, different chocolates, if that's correct. Eins, zwei, drei, vier, boom, yeah, it is boom. So let's just start with the one on the top, which is the Milka Erde Erdbeer Yogurt. This will be interesting. Okay. Okay. Okay, first of all, the chocolate is great. Second of all, the yogurt is great too. So, like the combination of the chocolate and the yogurt is just fabulous. I'm really confused by it though because I feel like I'm eating yogurt and then suddenly I feel like I'm eating chocolate and then I'm eating yogurt again. Like, what is this witchcraft? I have no freaking idea what to rate this. It's magical. I rate it magical out of 10. Okay, over to the next one, uh, which is the Milka Chips Ahoy. Uh, it looks like a cookie, so... Uh, and it's uh, Milka with cookie. This is Milka with cookie. This is magical too. Although this is a solid 10 out of 10. I love it. Germany, you know how to make candy. I'm so impressed right now. So the next thing I found in the box was this. Uh, it is uh, Brausepulver from a Bro. Oh, it was the same as the square. It's the same thing. Little QB. Also, hold on. Um, why is there a glass right there? Was I supposed to put it put this in water or something? That actually explains a lot. Citrone. And the green one is Waldmeister. Yeah, I have to try all of them. I guess Trinkwasser means like water, so I have water here and I have a 
cup here. Now I have to put 0.2 liters in the cup. Okay. I want to try the pink one first, which is Himbeer. Pour it in the cup. Yeah, that is 0.2 liters, I think. Oh my god! It turned the water into soda, holy shit! Mmm! I give that a 10 out of 10, holy shit, that was good! Okay, orange, water, orange. Oh my god, this is so cool. Okay, so I just got a spoon so I could mix it better. I never felt like that was necessary. Mmm, this is good too, but I actually like the Himbeer one better. Uh, I would give this a 9 out of 10. And I will go for the green one because it looks like watermelon. Like, what else would Waldmeister be? It smells weird, it smells like soap. Ew, what the heck was that? What is Waldmeister? Now I have to Google that. What the freak? Wal Waldmeister. No way. It is a freaking flower. So sorry, Germany. I don't like this. I would rate this 1 out of 10 because it tastes like flower. Okay, now for the last uh, Brausepulver, which is uh, Citron. Mmm, 10 out of 10. Mmm. Yeah, okay, so the next one is Milka with Dime. Uh, we have something similar in Norway called uh, Melkechoklade with Dime, which is milk chocolate with Dime. So I guess it will be pretty much the same thing, but hopefully it's as good as the Norwegian one, because the Norwegian one is good. Yep, it is good. I love Dime, I love chocolate. 10 out of 10. Milka with... Uh, I guess that's how you pronounce that. Tuk. Oh my god, this is like the cutest thing I've seen in my life. Look at this. Yes, this one. Wow. Okay, this is by far my favorite. It is a solid 11 out of 10. I'm not allowed to say that, but oh my god, this one. Wow. All right, so now for the last Milka bar. Um, Milka with Oreos. Oh my god, look at it. Uh, Oh my god, this is simply 11 out of 10. Um, this one, what, what is this? Kinder Happy Hippo Summer Spaz. I know what that means, it means summer fun, doesn't it? If that is correct, then I will be so proud of myself. This is what the Kinder Happy Hippo looks, lo looks like. I don't quite see how this is a hippo, but sure! It's the best thing I've had in my life. Do I seriously have to travel to Germany to get one of these? Because I would totally do that. This is out of the scale. This is, I can't rate this. It's too good. Mind blown, I'll give that. 10 hundred kabillion trillion billy milli trillion out of 10. Yeah. I think I've tried everything now except from this, uh, which is licorice, I guess, I suppose. Uh, and apparently it's veggie. I love licorice, so it should be good. Yes, it's good. I love it. Germany, you just found your way to my heart with all this candy. The licorice is uh, 10 out of 10. Now I still have tons of candy left, uh, but I've tried absolutely everything and wow, it was great. Overall, I'll give the German candy a solid 10 out of 10. I've never tried such good candy in my life. I'm still shocked over the Happy Hippo because that was amazing. And I also really, 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 really like the Knoppers and the Milkas and yeah, everything was so good. And again, a big thanks to Quentin for sending me all this German candy. And before I go, can you please explain to me how I eat these squares? I think I'm supposed to put them in water, but I have no idea. Yeah, okay, just tell me in the comment section below. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in two or three days with a brand new video. Again, danke. KPS, bye!